Hi, hi, so good to be here. I am Stephanie from Our Natural Wisdom and I want you to know that nature can bring you such peace and clarity, even in the most challenging moments, even in those moments where you're experiencing the most anxiety. And this is something that I love to teach, these simple practices that can help you center yourself and hear the beautiful wisdom that you hold within. Nature, Mother Earth can bring that out. It is all within you. And today I want to share a story about something in my personal life that happened a few years ago that is, I feel, such a, a great example of this. And it's really one of those stories that um, is, I think, the story of why I like to teach other women about this, the simple practice of opening yourself up to the wisdom that nature will bring forth, wisdom that is already within you. So here's my story. Um, about six years ago, almost exactly six years ago, we had a newborn son. He was beautiful, but he was struggling with eating issues. And we were really feeling nervous about it. We were concerned about the fact that he wasn't putting on weight as quickly as he should. And, um, it was bringing up a lot of anxiety within me. And of course, if, if you've had children, you know how, especially those first few months after you've had a child or adopted a child, there's so much anxiety and stress that goes along with it. It's just part of the parenthood journey. Well, I was feeling super anxious about this and he was constantly hungry and unsettled and that brought such pain to my my tender heart, my mom heart, who wanted everything to be okay and peaceful for our child. So we would spend hours in his nursery every single day because he was always hungry. He wasn't getting as much nourishment through our nursing as um, he needed to. So he was very unsettled. We were on a, on a very quick cycle of nursing, napping, nursing, uh, getting changed, you know, nursing some more, and it was it just went on and on. And I was starting to feel really housebound. It was increasing my anxiety and my worry and my concern for him. And of course, I was just dog tired as new moms are. And my brain was coming up with all sorts of very difficult thoughts about what was happening? What was wrong with him? What was I doing wrong? Why can't I do this? It was so easy with our daughter. Why is nursing, why is our breastfeeding journey so hard with my son? And, you know, when we ruminate, when we are in that anxiety stage, and we can just make things so much harder on ourselves than they really need to be, it's also a place where answers and the next step to take to address whatever challenge you're facing, that, that clarity can be so difficult to obtain, right? Because we're tired, we're anxious, we're stressed, we're concerned, we're focusing on the future and have grief about the past and we're not in the present moment. So, there I was in his nursery one day, just really feeling depleted and sad and anxious. And all of a sudden, I started looking around the room and I noticed the sunlight streaming in through the blinds and glowing on the floor. And it just really drew my awareness. And I thought about the sun and about heat and fire and warmth. And then I started looking around at the room some more and I saw all of the wood in the room. I saw the crib and the changing table and the wood on our chair. And I felt that I was very connected to the trees and to the ground and to the earth. And then of course I had a big jug of water next to me, as is so important for new moms. And I 
paused and took a nice deep long drink of water and just let that flow through my body and then I noticed that the mobile above our heads the mobile that we had hanging above our nursing glider was moving very subtly very gently in what was kind of an imperceptible movement of air in the room and it also had this beautiful rustling sound that I'll always remember, so peaceful. And I saw that air was present. And I realized that all of the elements of nature were present with me in that room, in that moment, indoors. Even though I felt like I hadn't been outside in nature in weeks, I had nature all around me and in fact flowing through me and bringing me into a place of greater calm. And I could feel my anxiety being relieved in that moment. And just involuntarily, I took a nice deep breath. And as I allowed myself to be in that place with nature, appreciating everything that Mother Earth was providing me indoors in that moment when I was really struggling, I could feel the wisdom and the presence and the love of my heart and my soul. And I heard the message that I knew what I needed to do, that I knew the next right step. And right, right then I made the commitment, which I followed through on, to call our pediatrician who had assured me that nothing was wrong, that he just needed to learn how to latch better and nurse better. But I knew that something else was going on. And I honored my inner wisdom. I honored my intuition, that mom's intuition. And I called my pediatrician and I insisted that something did not feel right. Something was not right and I wanted to talk with a specialist about it. And they got me in to see a lactation specialist. And sure enough, our son had a, he had um, a lip tie and a tongue tie. And if you know what this is or don't know what this is, it really affects their ability to physically latch and to nurse. And it affects not only breastfeeding, but also bottle feeding. So this was a big physiological challenge that our son was dealing with and that had eluded the notice of our pediatrician. They had not even seen that he had these issues. Hi, Jill. So good to join, to have you join us. Thank you. And so the fact that I heard that wisdom in that moment of peace, that moment of relief from anxiety, I heard what I needed to do. I knew in my heart that I needed to make that call and I took action on that and sure enough it resulted in the answers that we needed. The answers that were easily resolved, that addressed the challenges that we were facing and that set us down a, a course, a path that was so much healthier and so much better and less stressful for all of us. And the reason that I say this and share this story is, and I could share lots of stories personally and stories that my clients have experienced. When we allow ourselves to feel that peace that nature brings us and that time of being in the present moment, it is a beautiful opening to hear your deep wisdom, your natural wisdom, your intuitive guidance, that wisdom that everybody is born with and that we so quickly dismiss or have other people dismiss. And so we don't follow up on our wisdom. We don't take the steps, take the actions that will really make our lives so much easier and bring so much more peace and joy and fulfillment to our lives, to our family's lives, to the world around us. So I just want you to know that this can happen in mere moments. If you're experiencing a really challenging time, 
being able to come into presence and nature, Mother Earth is the most perfect partner in this to bring you into the present moment so that you can let all of the noise drop away and that you can hear your inner wisdom, your natural wisdom, your intuitive guidance. I that one sh action shifted everything for me as it has shifted many things for my clients and they're experiencing all of the benefits of that. And this is something that I feel so passionately about. I want more women who are struggling with anxiety and self-doubt and perfectionism, grief, all of these emotions that are a lot to bear, that feel heavy and they are truly doorways into a more full understanding of who you are. And the way to enter into that place with peace and with gentleness and with ease, one of the most beautiful ways is through connecting with Mother Earth. So today, I just want to invite you to take a moment here with me and look around wherever you are, if you're outside, if you're indoors, and just allow your heart this is not a logical exercise. Allow your heart to guide you to see something in your place that you are, the space where you are right now. Bring your awareness to something that is of nature, that feels natural to you. It could be something as simple as a plant or a stone or the hardwood floor or your glass of water. And just allow yourself to receive the peace that that item holds for you. And I know this might seem inaccessible. It might seem a little woo-woo. <laughs> but nature is just pouring out all of this support to you in every single moment. When you bring your awareness to something of nature and really allow yourself to be with that item, even for a few moments. You are bringing a relief to your nervous system. You're reminding yourself that you are of nature. You have a sacred partnership with nature. And this partnership is always offering you support, always. So just be with that item right now. Take some nice deep breaths. Feel how your body is relaxing into this moment. And allow yourself to feel that peace from the top of your head all the way down to the tips of your fingers, all the way down to the tips of your toes. And Listen within your heart for any guidance that you are hearing in this moment, anything that you are being guided to take action on or choose not to act upon. And receive that guidance from your natural wisdom, from your intuition. Receiving that with such gratitude Sending gratitude to your heart and soul. Sending so much gratitude to Mother Earth for all that she provides us in every moment. Thank you for taking the time to do this simple practice for yourself. And I would love to take a moment to invite you to bring more simple practices into your life. There is always an opportunity to connect more deeply with the earth and with everything that Mother Earth is offering to you. So much love and support and the reawakening of your natural wisdom. I offer a very special group coaching experience. It's called the Sacred Grove and enrollment is open right now. Our first gathering is on October 10th. 
we will be diving into very simple practices that you can do with Mother Earth to allow yourself to relieve anxiety, to hear the wisdom of your intuition, and to gain the clarity and the confidence to take action, to bring beautiful blessings into your life and to create more peace within your life and the life of all of those who you share your life with. All you have to do is click the link in bio for more information about the Sacred Grove, my unique group coaching program. Thank you so much for joining me today. I look forward to connecting with you again next week on Instagram Live at 2 p.m. on Tuesday. Have a beautiful day, everyone. Thanks again for joining. Bye-bye.